Welcome to phase four of cargo planning calculations. Today, we'll be looking at finding new draft using sinkage and rise. Initially, we looked at finding new draft with two densities. In other words, the vessel is moving from one port to another. Today, we are going to find new draft without. So let us look at finding new draft using weight and TPC. First, we look at sinkage, where sinkage is the number of centimeters that the mean or the old draft of a vessel would sink whenever cargo is loaded. The sinkage formula is weight divided by TPC. The result would be centimeters, which we would convert to meters by dividing by 100. And when we get that result, we would add it to the old or mean draft. Now, let us look at finding new draft using rise. Now rise is similar to sinkage except it occurs when the vessel is discharging cargo, when cargo is being removed from the vessel. Same formula, weight divided by TPC, and we do the same thing. We'll get centimeters, we'll convert to meters by dividing by 100, and then the result this time would be subtracted from the old draft. So sinkage, loading, increments or sinkage will be added to the mean or old draft. Rise on the other hand is discharge cargo, weight being removed from the vessel and the result would be subtracted from the old draft reducing the draft. Now let us look at an example. A vessel with a draft of 4.76 meters and TPC of 10 tons was loaded with 100 tons of cargo. Calculate the new draft using two decimal places. Now, since the vessel is loading, we would use the sinkage formula, where sinkage is weight divided by TPC. That would give us 100 divided by 10, equal 10 centimeters. We would convert that 10 centimeters by dividing by 100, resulting in 0 0.1 meters. Now, new draft would be equal to old draft plus sinkage. That is 4.76, the old draft, plus 0 0.1, which gives us 4.86 meters. Now, let us look at another example. Example 2. Same vessel with a draft of 4.76 meters, TPC of 10 tons, discharge this time 100 tons of cargo. We will calculate again the new draft using two decimal places. Now, since the vessel is discharging, we would use the rise formula, where rise is weight over TPC. That would be equal to 100 tons, again, divided by 10 tons, and that will give us 10 centimeters. Again, we convert 10 centimeters by dividing by 100, which equals 0 0.1 meters. This time, however, finding new draft would be equal to the old or mean draft minus the rise. That would give us 4.76 minus 
0.1 meters, which results in 4.66 meters. We must ensure whenever we are trying to find new draft, once we know the weight and we have found the TPC, we will ensure that what we are going to divide, the result is going to give us centimeters. And so we must, we must ensure that we divide it, that centimeters by 100 to bring it to meters because everything else is already in meters. So bear in mind, subscribe, like, and share. And we look forward to seeing you soon when we return with phase five, where we will be discussing new displacement. See you soon. Remember, like, share, and subscribe to Lane's ED Enhancement.